Good morning, everybody. Happy Saturday. It's update day, as you guys all know. Everyone knows it's going to be the Easter update today. That's pretty good. It'd be pretty fun. We've got some new huges that are coming out. We've got the painted cat, the Easter bunny, and then rumors of a Easter looking Dominus. And then, of course, the Easter hoverboard is going to be coming as well. There's going to be new breakables, um, things like that to try to hatch the huges, which will be super fun because we're kind of out of things to do at this point. Um, basically, what my friends and I have been doing for the last few days is hatching the dojo egg and the cafe egg, just trying to get the kawaii huges or trying to get the uh, shiny secret owls, um, those kinds of things. Been selling a lot of, selling a ton of the dark matter cupcake unicorns in the plaza. Um, so if you're needing huge pets or trying to get huge pets, that's the best way to do it is to go ahead and take out, take it and try to hatch the uh, hardcore pets so that you can get some other huges. Um, and so we're just kind of waiting for the update now. It's going to start. It's going to reset here shortly. So we're just kind of waiting for that. But again, happy Saturday. I hope you guys are all doing well. So the, ser the server that we're in has not reset yet. However, the server that my alt's in did just reset and the update says easter obby easter island easter currency easter pets easter eggs easter egg hunt easter quests easter bunny hunt easter hoverboard easter booth easter gifts and updates weekly so we'll check that out here shortly once we get into a new server once this one resets um which should be really soon at this point all right so we just reset in this server finally and as I just mentioned, um, there's Easter Abbey, Easter Island, all this other stuff. And it looks like up here that if you stay online for an hour, then you'll also get a free Easter basket gift. Uh, so I'm not sure what that will actually be, but that will be pretty cool once we see what that actually looks like. So we'll definitely stay online for the hour. But let's go ahead and go down to the shop and see where this Easter Island is, how we get the coins. I'm sure they're just going to be breakables like I mentioned, but let's go check it out. So here's, okay, here we go. So Easter event, um, hop, hop, hop. Uh, okay. Well, I'm not sure what that means. So we can't get into that quite yet. That's okay. Let's go break some of these things. So someone in here says he's on the obby and uh, someone else says it doesn't work. So we're not sure what that's really looking like quite yet. Um, let's just break a few more of these things and see if we can actually get into the obby. And also if we can find Easter Island, I wonder if it's one of the places we can teleport to. So it doesn't look like it, which is kind of weird, um, but that's okay. You probably have to do the Easter Obby first before you can actually get to it. So I'm not really sure on that one, um, but so far we've collected, what, 30,000 Easter coins. And again, we're just in spawn, so we could probably be making a whole lot more going to other worlds, but um, I just wanted to kind of check it out and see what these actually were. So let's go back up here and see if anything has changed with this obby thing in this Easter event area. So it doesn't seem to be doing anything. Okay, so it truly is an obby. So you can't be on your hoverboard, I just learned, in order to get up to the obby so you have to jump basically you have to go to where the little easter event thing is and then you have to kind of parkour the little the little stuff here and we're going to try to get through it i'm terrible at obbies like terrible 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 so hopefully i don't fall off Okay, where am I supposed to be going to? 
right there, apparently. And then over here, and then over here. This is tricky. I don't like hobbies. <laughs> but apparently people on my server do. They think it's fun, so all good. Oh, I missed that one. Dang it! I have to go all the way back to the beginning. Like I said, I'm terrible at obbies. Terrible, terrible. Alright, let's try that again. Okay, so I had to have my daughter actually do the obby because I'm terrible at obbies. But now we're actually up in this little Easter area and we've got um, some eggs. My mouse is not cooperating. I want it to pan out. So we've got ribbon eggs. They're 280K and 2.6 million. Let's go look and see what's actually in them. So looks like this is either, that looks like the painted cat is what it looks like. So there's got to be another egg somewhere because there's an Easter bunny also. So I'm kind of curious what we'll find if we go and like start wandering through the little area here. There's probably or possibly one hidden like there was in the fall event that um, cost gems actually. But let's take a look and see if we can find anything over here. Not seeing anything yet. Oh, what's that little light coming up? I don't know. And then let's see. Yeah, I don't see any other egg back here, which is kind of weird. There's a little bunny hill right here. Oh, there we go. There's a little door that you have to go have to open. To enter the bunny's hut, you must complete this quest. Start. Yes, I want to start. Break 200 Easter coins. Oh, man, I have to go back and do the obby again? Return when you've finished. That's terrible news. Oh, my gosh. Okay, so it looks like my daughter's going to be doing this more than once today, which will be fun. All right, so let's go back. Let's just jump off the planet. And then hopefully it'll put me back down. And we're going to just float all the way down. Let's get our hoverboard so it makes it faster. So 200. I already think I broke like 20, but... Oh, it helps if I put some pets on, actually. Alright, so let's do some single pet sending. And then I'm going to go ahead and work through this, and I'll come back once I get through it. I won't painfully put you through me going and finding 200 things to break, because that's going to take a little bit of time. So, hope you guys are doing the same. Good luck. We'll see you back here soon. So, we found all three of the scavenger hunt pets. They are in the steampunk chest, which is pretty standard. Uh, pixel vault, and then also in the um, doodle fairyland, and it's by the castle door. So, if you're trying to find those... That's where they are right now. Um, we're going to go get the one in the Pixel Vault here next. So far we haven't gotten any of the huges. Um, but that's okay. So we're trying to get through this 200 coin piles um, breaking so we can actually get the, the next quest. I don't see where it's at in the Pixel Vault though. So let me go around here. Oh, there it is. I see it. Let's see if we can get a huge. Nope, just another safari cat. All right, well, that's okay. Those are good to, to sell in the plaza and also to just give away to people because um, they're good pets. They're event pets and they're companion pets, which is always good. But they're, um, they're definitely not something that uh, helps a whole lot from a perspective of um, getting... like getting more sales and stuff in the, the trading plaza and stuff like that. So we're going to keep doing um, our quests and then we'll come back here shortly. All right. So we finally finished quest number one. So now we're going to try to go and get through quest number two. And um, I'm pretty sure it's going to be those little um, eggs breaking those open. Just, we're just not sure how many we're going to have to open yet. So 
One second. All right, so we finally made it back up to the Easter Island, and now we're going to go see what the second quest is. So now we have to break 30 Easter egg coins. So another 30? Why is it st it's the same thing? That's kind of weird. But, okay, let's go break another 30. Let's jump off this little world here. And let's equip some pets again. And boom. Alright, so. Oh man, I missed my banana boosts and stuff already. I missed the little speed thing. That was super fun. I actually went this morning and stocked up to have about 300 of each of them, just in case it was going to actually carry over. I kind of figured it wasn't, but I thought maybe we'd get lucky and be able to keep them. And not so much. <laughs> Someone is popping everything in here. So let's go to a different world just so we're not taking other people's stuff. Alright, so we should be getting really close to hitting 30 of these things at this point. Because I know we got at least 10 or 15 in spawn. And then we jumped over here because there was someone trying to do the same thing in spawn. And we didn't want to take their stuff because... You know, if they're doing the 200 one, that takes a little bit of time anyways. For me, I just went to Cat, and I just went in the very first area of Cat and just started breaking everything, so it just respawned the coin piles pretty quickly. So it didn't take that long just by doing that. Um, so it looks like someone's actually in here too, but we should be close to done at this point. I'm just waiting for the little message to pop up and tell us that we have successfully completed the second quest. Um... Kind of surprised it hasn't done it yet, actually. Let's keep breaking a few more. I knew somebody would be so lucky. Yes. Oh, okay. Hi, I think we all right, so now it looks like we've got the quest that's come up to find Easter eggs, and I can actually see one right here where I'm at. So I'm not sure. Do we go and push the E? Can we just click on it? How come I can't click it? That's weird. Oh, there it is. E. Okay. I got an egg chick. We should probably actually turn off our auto deletes on this too, so we can actually keep some of these pets. Um, we'll delete them as we need to, but. Um, okay, so there's literally a hundred of these, and that's going to take a while, especially if there's literally only a hundred of them. Um, but let's start going through here. Oh, here's another one right here. Oh, I got a spring griffin, a mythical. That's pretty cool. So I'm curious if some of these are like off in the, the side somewhere or off in the like no man's land basically because a hundred is a lot. Oh, it looks like there's three. Oh, there's a giant one in here. That's pretty cool. Let's open this one. A golden egg chick. That's cute. Let's see what this giant one does. <clears throat> Uh, Easter's. Oh, that's really cool, actually. Nice, nice, nice. <clears throat> and another egg chick. Oh, there's actually four in Steampunk. Another spring griffin. Those are cute, actually. I like those. And they're mythical, so I'm actually wondering what their damage is. Let's go look at their damage. Because if we can actually make some, let's go look. Hey, over there, 8.4. That's actually pretty good. So uh, and that's, a, that's a golden one, obviously. But um, yeah, I'm curious what they'll be as dark matter. So 
I'll check that out here after a while and see see what they actually would end up with at Dark Matter. But we're going to keep going through here. And we're still trying to finish that 30 <clears throat> pile quest, which is, kind of, again, super weird because I would think that we'd have had it by now. But that's okay because we're going to find these Easter eggs anyways. So more egg chicks. Oh, an Easter axolotl. That's cute. And it's legendary. Let's break this little pile here. Then let's go over here. Another spring griffin. That's cool. Let's see if there's, oh, there's an egg up here. <clears throat> A rainbow egg chick. That's cute. Let's go get this one that's up here in the corner. And then we're going to run back through tech really quick because um, we were only about halfway through tech when we actually started the Easter egg hunt itself. So I'm sure that we've probably missed them in here, and I want to make sure that we're done with tech completely before we move on. So I wonder if there's one over here by the Dark Matter machine. Actually, there's not, which is interesting. But, but there's not, so that's okay. Um, let's go ahead and keep moving through here. I don't see any others over here. And we're going to keep breaking these Easter coin piles too because we're going to need those obviously when we start hatching and stuff as well. So there's a couple of eggs over here. That's a different egg. That's cute. Let's see what we got. All right, so we found 13 so far. And there's another one over here. So that's 14. And then let's go, um, actually there's another one right here too. And then let's go into the alien chest. Because there's probably some in there. Because there was four in the steampunk chest area. I like the Easter Alps lot. It's really cute actually. It's one of the cuter ones. Alright, so none over here. Oh, there's an egg back there. So only one in this particular area. But that's okay. And it looks like we've got about six minutes left on our countdown for our Easter gift. So I'm really curious what that's going to be also. Hopefully it's something really good and not something that we can just hatch out of all the normal stuff anyways. And then here's another egg. There's a lot in tech, actually. I'm kind of surprised about that. Um, but that's okay. We'll take it. And I think we're starting to lag a little bit. Oh, there's another one also. Oh, no, that's that one. Just kidding. And there's one right here. So my daughter's asking, can you find peaches in the eggs? And the answer is yes, because you can see right here, um, when you have the little E sign on the egg, there is a huge in that egg. So I'm thinking that it's probably the bunny. It's kind of small and I haven't made it bigger, so I should just so I can actually look at it. But um, let's go down here and see if there's any eggs hiding down here. Don't see any down here. Um, she's asking how long does it go for before it ends. I don't know the answer to that question. So I would say, like, let's do it as quickly as we possibly can. All right, so we've got all the ones we think that are in tech. So we're going to go start over and shop and try to get um, whatever eggs are actually up here in the shop. So let's go, first of all, over here and let's try to see. Um, it says I received an Easter gift. Happy Easter. Well, for what? It's a booth. Oh. And then there's an egg on the stairs. Let's go see if there's any more up here, like down in the Dominus area. And there's not, um, so that's okay. And there's no more over there. So let's see if there's any over here by the leaderboard. 
I don't see any there either. Let's go take a look in the daycare real quick. Because a good hiding place would actually be behind this daycare. Let's get off the hoverboard because it makes it more complicated. Nope. I don't see any behind the daycare. So let's go ahead and get out of here. I know the big eggs do look like they're going to contain huges, huh? <laughs> I know. It'd be super cool if it actually had a huge in it, but they don't. And then, let's see. All right. So, let's go take a peek over at the huge atron machine. Also, see if there's any eggs in here. Just before we move on, because we don't want to miss any since there are exactly a hundred. Um, we definitely don't want to miss anything, so. All right. Oh, here's one right here. And I'm going to go ahead and keep finding these and then come back once we get a little closer just to save some time. So we were down to only needing three more eggs. We know two of them were in the cat throne room. Um, however, we would need to go to normal to get them because we don't have the cat throne opened in hardcore. However, um, what we just learned is the event actually went away. Um, so apparently it only lasted like, what was it, 30 minutes or an hour. So I guess we lost out on that one, which totally stinks because we were so, so close to it. So I'm not sure what you even get from that, but um, probably the hoverboard is what I'm guessing, but maybe not. Um, maybe just a great egg or maybe something really cool, but that's really too bad. Definitely not happy, Uncle Preston, that you took that away so quickly, especially when people were so close to actually getting it. So anyways, that's a total bummer, but we're going to go back up now because we did complete the second quest while we were doing that. And we're going to go check it out and see if there's any other quests to be had at this time. So we're still super bummed out that the 100 eggs um, event ended because it's funny. You can see actually we're back up here and you can't actually get to the third quest. You can't get to, well, the third quest actually is the, um, oh, hey, maybe it did. That actually just let me in. That's weird because I never found the uh, third Huh, I never found the third one. Oh, there's my hoverboard right there. Well, that's pretty cool. I'm going to take that. That's awesome, awesome, awesome. So, I guess you didn't have to actually complete it. Maybe maybe you had to be like a certain percentage done, or, or I'm not sure. But thank you, Preston, for at least giving us that and honoring that because we were almost done with it. So, super cool that we actually did that. Now, my, people, my friends are asking me, how did I do that in the chat? So... I'm going to go tell them and then I'm going to post this video so you guys can all see it. So if you started the quest for the 100 eggs and you didn't actually get them um, and it goes and tells you on the little house that the third quest is to get the 100 eggs. Um, I went and hatched some of these eggs. I went and hatched probably 100 or 200. And then I went and actually tried to open the little house again, a little secret room again, and it actually opened and gave me the hoverboard. So... Anyways, guys, um, do the same thing if you haven't done so already. Hope you're having a great Saturday, and we will catch you all soon. Thanks, guys.